Okay, you might think you have no time for exercise. Yes, I have reached for that excuse myself a time or two, but if you have 10 minutes, apparently that's plenty of time to get stronger and get slimmer by summer. Trainer Kelly Betridge is ready to share her favorite at-home workout for those busy mom days on the go, and you say the main excuse that your clients tell you really is time, right? I don't it have is. time. It seems like something always gets in the way when you're trying to get in a workout. There's just never enough time. It's kind of the first thing to go from your busy schedule. So what makes this workout compatible with that excuse? Hit training. So high intensity interval training. Take the intensity up and the time you need to spend goes down. We've been hearing about HIT training, I feel like, so much the last two or three years. Are people catching on to the appeal of it? Yeah, I, I feel like the, you know, the more you keep your heart rate up, the more calories you're gonna burn, burn the more effective your workout's gonna be. So high intensity, we want our heart pumping. You're also putting us on sort of a circuit so we don't get too bored, right? Yes. Mixing it up, move mm -hmm. to move. Yes, so yeah, circuit is just a group of exercise. You know, pick four or five exercises and then you're gonna circuit through them, repeat back through them. What makes a good circuit? I know you're gonna demonstrate one for us, but what's the components of a really good circuit workout? Um, so you can kind of split it up a couple different ways. Um, if you wanna do a full body, you can do lower, upper core cardio. So a lower body exercise, upper body um, core exercise, and then a cardio move to kind of keep that intensity high. Okay. Um, or you can split it up and do like all, you know, switch it into we're gonna focus on legs today. So uh -huh. well, that's kind of what we're gonna do today. We're gonna focus on a leg circuit, really get those glutes ready for summer. So. I was thinking Kelly was my friend and I said on the way in, you're going to take it easy on me, right? And she said, yeah, maybe, <laughs> or not. We'll see. <laughs> we like TV friendly workouts, <laughs> Kelly. No, let's jump into this first circuit. You're recommending just a set of dumbbells, right? Yes, so we're gonna just take four lower body exercises. So first we're gonna start with squats. So just grab one dumbbell. Okay, just gonna Kelly hold did like kindly this. give me the eight pounders <laughs> and kept the 10 pounders for herself. Okay, I'm okay. just gonna hold like this and just squat Squats back. Yes, and so feet slightly wider than shoulder width. Try and touch your elbows to your knees. Oh, that's low. Stick your butt out. That's the main thing with, I see with squats is people don't stick their butt out. So their knees are extending over their toes. Right, we want to maintain our posture. Yes, good. So we're just going to do about five of those. So now grab another dumbbell. So we do that for how long? So normally when you're at home, 15 reps of each exercise. Okay. But we're on a time crunch with TV, so yes. I'm shortening it a little bit and I don't want to kill you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, friend Kelly. So when you're at home, I like to set a timer, eight minutes. Okay. You've got your four exercises. We're gonna go into lunges now. Okay. So step backward. Yep. So if you're doing a backward lunge, you're gonna focus more on glutes and uh -huh. hamstrings versus front lunge, you're gonna focus more on the quads, the front part but of the leg. But you can mix it up going front to back. Yeah, you can mix it up going front to back and get a good, good full, either way you're both. Okay, we got our squats, we got our lunges, then what? All right, so now we're gonna come into a deadlift. So knees slightly bent, just like softly bent. Okay. Butt out. Butt out. Shoulders back. <laughs> Make sure that back straight and you're just gonna come down, uh -huh. up, and really squeeze those glutes as you come up. You feel so awkward doing this move. Okay, okay, okay good, so I'm doing it right. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> so keep those hands really close to your leg. You almost want to like graze in your legs and okay. get down. And really and squeeze those glutes okay. as you come up. I'm squeezing. <laughs> good, let's do that. That was our deadlift. More. Yes. One and two. Why am I counting down? Isn't that your job? <laughs> I'm just wishing it away. It. <laughs> okay. Okay, so now we're just gonna do a cardio move to get the intensity up. So we're gonna come down here, jump back. Oh, and lady. And up. up. Okay. <laughs> Good. Kind of like a glorified burpee. Yeah, I didn't want to say the word burpee. Yeah, you're new to our team, but you know those are banned in the studio, right? <laughs> people get people get afraid to say the word burpee, but people detest the word burpee move. by people I mean me. I mean me, but it's a good one. It's a good one. Okay, what else? So that that's it for that circuit. So Ooh. what you would do, just repeat that. You set your timer for eight minutes. Okay. It's so easy at home to get distracted by. Let me throw a load of laundry totally. in, or you know, cooking dinner or whatever, but if you set a timer for eight minutes, you've got 15 reps, pick four exercises, and then just keep repeating those exercises okay. until the time goes up. And of those four, three of them are kind of muscle oriented, right? We are working the legs, the glutes. Yeah, even, even that cardio move is still gonna really work on your glutes and your hamstrings. Okay. But it's also gonna get that heart rate up, so you can feel, I'm, I'm out of breath now, so hopefully you're a little bit out of breath. I'm fine, <laughs> I'm just fine. No, I am, you feel it, even in that short time. <laughs> yes. And of course, if we weren't staring at all of these TV cameras, mm -hmm. we'd be getting it out and going for it and yeah, really so. sweating and panting. Okay, could you give us an arm one to do? Yeah, so um, you can easily just do so. Shoulder move, this is called an Arnold press, starting here. Named after? Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> of course, okay. <laughs> so we're just gonna bring it up and back down. Okay. If you really want to pick up the intensity, you can add a squat to it. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. And what's the key to protecting our shoulders? 
Um, just making sure that you're keeping it close, close to your body and you're just twisting up here. Make sure you always get warm up beforehand. I think that rotation just, sometimes scares people, right? When yeah. you're going in and out. Yeah, it does. But if you're keeping it close to your body and then just coming up here, you're into a natural movement. This is a military press. Okay. And so that's pretty natural, easy for your arm. So just make sure you're not going too heavy, too heavy on the weight. I was just distracted by the gun show that was happening over there. I was <laughs> going to pretend my arms look like yours, okay? In my head they do. All right, what else? So even just curls, you yeah. can do a curl up okay. to a press if okay. you wanted or even you know do curl with some lunges okay really pick up the intensity and women are kind of scared of weights and we're trying to I know get over that sticker yes. but what's a good weight to start they're, with they're afraid they're gonna wake up and look like Arnold Schwarzenegger yeah that's not accidentally gonna happen so when you're choosing a weight if you're doing you know 15 rep, reps which is what I recommend for this circuit you want those last three to four reps to be really challenging hard yeah if you can get in 20 reps with that weight it's not heavy enough like you should be shaky you, you should, should be, be kind of weak you want to be able to maintain Maintain good form, full range of motion, but if you can get more reps in than we're going for, it's not heavy enough. Okay, so. the circuit hit training, that's where it's at, especially for us busy women, right? Yes. Where can we get more of your advice? Um, I post a lot of videos on my Instagram, Trainer Kelly, just follow me there. All right, we'll do it. Thank you so much, you were pretty kind. <laughs> pretty kind, minus You did a awesome. burpee. <laughs> I'll forgive you for that.